Uh, hello, my name is Eduardo and I will show you, well, this video is to group the tech class X10 Plus. X10 Plus is, is a very nice tablet, okay, but um, I found that it's not very easy to group, okay. Well, first, first of all, um, I wanted to group it because um, it has many Chinese applications, okay. So, and um, sometimes I don't like that because sometimes it's like installing things that you don't want to have, okay? Well, that was the main purpose for me, okay? But, well, there are many reasons to get a uh, root your tablet, okay? Well, let's continue with this, okay? Just be careful and follow the steps, okay? And remember, I am not responsible for any damage to your uh, Teclas X10 Plus. Well, the first thing that we have to do is go to this uh, sites okay and download and extract these files so when you extract these two folders the these two files you will have two folders android 5.1 and root techless extend first we're going to work with android 5.1 so we enter and now in this I just write just for you the names, okay, well, the order. You have to install these files in the correct order. First, you have to install this one, the ISOC USB driver setup 1.2.0. After you finish to install this, you are going to install second, okay, well, you don't have second in your driver. It's the Intel Android drivers setup 1.50. And after this one, you have to install the phone flash tool. Something important in here, you have to accept all the install and uninstall messages. Okay, because when you start installing the second one, it will say, hey, I have a, an update version from a previous driver or, driver or something. Well, you just accept all the messages about uninstalling and installing, okay, files. You have to go to your tablet, to your Teclas X10, and you have to enable USB debugging. Okay, it is in developer options and also ON unlock. You have to open a Windows command prompt as an administrator inside the root Teclas X10 Plus. I did this process, but I will show you how to make this. So we are here in this folder. So you have to do this, you go to File in your Windows, File, open this thing, the Windows prompt, or in Spanish it's a system symbol, and then as an administrator, you say yes, and that's it. You have here this thing to write the next comment. Okay, in the first one, when you do this, uh, Command your tablet with boot, okay, in fast mode. So don't touch your tablet, just leave it like that. Then you continue with this command, the fast boot or non lock. You have to wait. Then it, it will display a message in your computer that says, okay, done. Then fast boot, flash boot, boot dot img, and you wait again, okay. And the last command is fast boot, reboot, and the tablet will reboot. Now, let's go to the next step. Remember, all these steps, you have to do it one by one. Then, set your Windows computer in Chinese or to Chinese. Okay, well, to do that, you have to go to Options or Configuration. Then you go to this Control Panel. And then you go here to clock, uh, language and region. And then you have to style by changing here in region. You go to region and you will have this. Then you go to admin. And then you have to change here. For example, my current language it is Spanish or Mexico. I change here, you click here. 
this is uh, the language for non-unicode uh, software then you go here to Chinese and you select China Chinese traditional Hong Kong RAE you click accept and it will say say you know I have to reboot or reset the computer you accept the message and you reset your computer okay so don't worry you just uh, will see some little changes for the Chinese okay but it's very important this step to continue then you have to enter to this folder okay the one that is in the root tech class with this Chinese uh, thing and then you have to execute root bat okay well this is just like this let's go you enter here and then here you have root dot bat okay or this thing well you have to execute this thing now some comments about this uh, you will see several messages okay and at the end but if you see some error messages that this thing didn't work okay so I recommend you run it uh, as an administrator execute it as an administrator but if not do it normally because well in in a forum okay some people were doing this as uh, administrators okay but when I tried it like that I was uh, receiving these uh, errors and it was not working for me so and then I did it just normally okay just double click and that's it and it worked really nice okay so only if you receive error messages try it as administrator okay then after this uh, boots you have to find super soup okay so you find super soup and try to update it it will fail the update no problem you click ok to restart the tablet in the super suit has this option and that's it when the tablet reboots okay it is not connected connect to the tablet and execute again the root uh, dot that well it is important to execute this for the second time and again if for you work the uh, as an administrator do it like that if not it's not necessary and that's it you will have your tech class x10 plus updated or rooted sorry updated okay well that was all i hope you can understand in, uh, uh, this thing okay this tablet works okay and with the root i guess it works better after you install this root uh, i recommend you go for a uh, titanium backup and remove all the chinese apps that you don't want to have if you don't want to have them okay well that was all my name is eduardo and thanks for watching this and i hope it was understandable i will see you next time